Hello, friends. Welcome to the Nova Coach Podcast, episode 357, New Nickname. I'm your host, Suzanne Kohlberg, joining you from the midway point of the school holidays. So my children are aged eight and 10. They're in year six and year four here in Australia. Year six is the last year of primary school. We start high school in year seven. And um, yeah, the first term of the school year this year was 11 weeks. Nominally, they're 10. 11 was tough. It was tough. Um, but apparently Queensland, I live in New South Wales, but Queensland, which is a more north state, for those of you not from Australia, their 11-week term is the last term of the year. So I'm like, yeah, I think I'd rather have it out in term one than be term four. But anyway, in the last week of school, my daughter Xanthi, so my 10-year-old, came home from school one day and she's like, I'm making new nicknames for everybody based on their initials. And I was like, oh, that sounds cool. Uh, make one for me. And she's like, yeah, you're senior citizen. <laughs> I was like, in that case, I changed my mind. Anyway, I posted about it on social media and a number of my friends were like, oh, do me. Oh, do me. And like this child of mine, the reason I'm recording this episode today is because it's Sunday. Welcome to Sunday Snark. It must run in the family. She is harsh, like a solid burn. She did... um. Hairy Tyrannosaurus for someone. Their initials were HT. She did Salty Garbage. I posted that kind of with a with bated breath, but I was like, if you've commented on a post where a kid's just called their mum a senior citizen, then you know you're going to get it. And there was also Just Socks. There was all sorts of things. So if you want a little Sunday pick-me-up or when you're listening to it and you want to be potentially burned by a 10-year-old, uh, comment on this video if you're watching on YouTube. And if you're listening to it on um on Spotify or Apple or whatever. This is an invitation to come find me on YouTube, Suzanne Kohlberg YouTube, episode 357, a new nickname. Sometimes your YouTube names aren't your actual names. So if you just want to pop your initials in, um, or maybe if you want to give her a uh, challenge, you could just make up initials because she won't know. Um, yeah, if you want a, a new nickname based on your initials or the initials that you choose, comment on the YouTube video and, uh, yeah, I'll just but pr be, be warned. She's harsh, like salty garbage, senior citizen. She doesn't mince her words and she has an incredible vocabulary for a 10-year-old. I was helping my 8-year-old with his reader, like his home reader for homework, and we came across a word. I can't even remember what it was, and I had no idea what it was. And, anyway, my 8-year-old's like, the teacher says when we don't know a word, we we read the sentence around it in context and try and decipher it. And I'm like, still don't know, dude. I was like, we have to get the dictionary. And then my 10-year-old's like, I know what it means. And she just sashays in and announces it. Speaking of sachets, <laughs> this is a total tangent. But anyway, when I was a kid, when I went to school, a sachet was like a sideways movement, like a hop to the side. And the other day, for some reason, I was talking to Xanthi, my 10-year-old, about sashaying, and she was like, what do you mean a sideways movement? So I demonstrated it. Don't worry. I'm not going to get up and sashay across the, the screen for you. You can, you know. And she's like, that's not a sashay. And I can't remember what she called it. She had another name for it. And then she's like, that makes no sense. I'm like, no, no, that's what a sashay is. So then she goes to her room, speaking of a kid with an impressive um vocabulary grabs one of her novels off the shelf brings it to me and goes so are you saying when this book says and she sashayed out of the room she did that and I was like oh and she's like this is what a sachet is and she does the swinging hips as she's like sachet off but anyway <laughs> Sunday snark I hope you've enjoyed this episode new nickname new knowing to what sachet means if you want to potentially be burned drop your initials in the uh comments of the video or make up some initials and um, her name starts with an X. So I really struggled to come up with her version of this, but uh, yeah, I would love to see what we come up with. Thanks for joining us. Hope to catch you on the next one. Bye for now.